September 4, 2021 This is probably one of the simplest birthdays I had so far, yet still, it's a very memorable one. I had it intimately with my family and I wouldn't have it in any other way. My heart is filled with love, with joy and peace, and that I am immensely grateful for reaching this part. It has been a crazy year, you know, but guess what? I'm still here, thriving and growing, preparing for what's to come. By the time this video is uploaded, I'm already 22, though I don't really look like one. Yes, you're right, I'm a Virgo. Moving on, who could even withstand the cuteness of this little girl? Like, look at those round, twinkling eyes and her sweet smile. <sighs> it melts every worry and problem there is again. I suddenly miss being a little kid. Yes, it's September which means we're back to school. And I'm currently a fourth year medical technology student, or should I say, a medical technology intern? But to be honest, this isn't the way I imagined things to be. Studying in the four corners of my room when we should be out there, dealing with actual patients, experiencing on-hand laboratory procedures, making friends with other interns from different schools, warding, or doing toxic duties, or even seeing ourselves in our scrub suits and clinical uniforms, which I think excites me the most, and yeah, all that stuff. I felt like this pandemic robbed something that's precious to me, and I miss my old life. I mean, we all do. Who doesn't even miss their pre-COVID life? But this is the new normal and we have no other choice but to accept and live with it. Let us be courageous when faced with adversity. So take a deep breath, inhale, exhale. Morgan Harper Nicholas said, and I quote, Take heart, breathe deep. So much is uncertain, and this remains true. The ground is still steady beneath your feet, and the sky is still wide with hope above you. Wow, what a word. With everything that's happening around us, all of the uncertainties brought about by this pandemic, one thing I am sure of is that he is in control. He is the God even before coronavirus even existed. And the moment that thought struck my mind, I found peace in Him, knowing that there are so many things I do not yet know, so many uncertainties, but amidst it all, I can still know peace. And I hope you find that peace too. By the way, I also went back to something I've set aside for the longest time. The last time I painted was a year ago, I think. And one fact about me is that I love creative minds, though I don't really call myself an artist because I think the word artist is too big for me and that it doesn't suit me. It just happened that I love appreciating artworks and making one when I had the time. It's also a great time to unwind and reflect how good God is. His creation is a reflection of His creativity and wisdom. So yeah, I celebrated every bit of September, though it went by so fast. So that's how my September went. So tell me, what's not to love about September? Golden there 